the Baltic Sea area is for Neste, the area which is uh, physically and geographically close to our core refining and retail assets in the region. So it means countries like, for example, Finland, Sweden, the Baltic states, and also, for example, Denmark. For the retail business, Baltic Sea is the three Baltic countries and Northwest Russia and Finland as well. We have a large number of uh, customers in the Baltic Sea market and it covers different type of companies. For example, uh, fuel retailers, industrial companies uh, and also some refining companies. The market is not growing fast in overall terms. However, there is a number of very interesting trends. So there is clearly a growing need for low carbon solutions driven by growing bio mandates. There is the need for premium qualities in order for our customers to differentiate. And also there is clearly a need for some uh, clean fuel special solutions. A competitive advantage that Neste is building on is the unique combination of uh, our three business areas and the capability to create tailor-made solutions including both fossil and renewable products. Digital services like customer loyalty programs etc. are very important in the future to our business. Our competitive advantage in oil retail is that we know the market, we know our customers, but there's still a lot of to do. I believe we have good products, we have a good service, but of course we need more customer understanding. We are very agile in the Baltics. In Finland the market is flat, but we have to do uh, more work towards the customer. As an example, I could name from the oil products perspective that uh, we could create uh, unique blends of Next PTL and fossil diesel, for example. Uh, we also work a lot on solutions uh, including services. So again, an oil products example, uh, it could be a tailor-made logistical service uh, for our customers, uh, combining different products. And uh, this covers for us a number of areas. It means that we want to really focus on growing with our key customers in this area. Uh, we also target, especially from an uh, oil products perspective, a step change in operational performance when it comes to uh, reliability, safety, cost. Uh, and as a third area, I would uh, again from an oil products perspective highlight that we are uh, implementing a clear asset development program uh, which enables us to respond to the market trends. So for example, we are increasing feedstock flexibility, reducing fuel oil output.